So welcome back to another video. So today I'm going to show you the new update on the Mevo Plus FS Golf app for PC. Uh, I'm in my backyard right now and I'm using, I'm going to be using a laptop. So this is something new that Flyscope is doing and they never had this on the Mevo Plus. The options were to use your either your uh, iPhone or Android device, uh, iPad or any other uh, tablet but there was no option on using PC. So I'm gonna show you how it works and I'm gonna give you my opinion on it. So stay tuned. Okay, so I connected the units and this is the screen that I got on my laptop. Uh, initially, I was disconnected for some reason. So I had to go back into the bottom there where it says disconnected and I press on it and basically what it asked me is to scan the unit so make sure you have a camera on your laptop or any other device i'm sure you can do it differently but that's the way i did it so what i did i scanned the code and, uh, and then after that it asked me for an update so make sure to do that um, i did the update and after that everything uh, ran smooth just like the like it did on the ipad Okay, so this is the screen that you get. Uh, I was hitting, uh, I started with a night iron, I hit a few shots, and it kind of feels like a little bit like Trackman. I guess the setup is that one. Um, if you notice, when I hit the ball, uh, it takes time until it lands, and it won't give you the info until it lands, I guess. So I'm not sure if that's just the software, the way it works, but the setup is pretty neat. I think it's very professional. <clears throat> it works a little better than the iPad, I would say. Uh, it's a little more, um, a, a little faster, I would say, and more reactive. Uh, and I like the the trajectory view better on the on PC here. I think this could be good for those who enjoy PC better than having an iPad. Um, I just want to show you something here. This is on the driver. Uh, I'm sure they're working on it, but when the ball lands, it kind of like self-corrects. And then this one it initially gave me like a little pull and then it, it was a, a fade. I can confirm to you that it felt more like a fade. So that's normally what I hit. Um, but I'm sure they're working on that. Uh, the look is very professional. I like that for sure. You can work on a lot of your stats here. And then you, you got all the information, uh, just like on the FS um, Golf app. And you can save it, you have the video as well, everything else. So I think this just gives you another option to use your PC. Like for me, I think it's pretty good because I could actually set up my PC in my backyard and just like leave it there and then just hook it up instead of um, having to bring my iPad every time downstairs. So I think it's a great option in my opinion. Uh, definitely feels very professional. Uh, I think it will uh, is geared towards a lot of pros, um, instructors as well. I think you know because you can work with a lot of numbers here, so it's it's pretty neat overall. I would say. All right, guys. So that was it for the video. I'm pretty happy with the new update because it gives you this option to use your PC to see your stats. Uh, you can email um, all the information. Obviously, uh, the the PC version uh, is free of charge for anyone who has a pro package. So if you have the pro package, you probably already got an email saying that uh, you can download the software and use it on PC. So for those who don't have the pro package, you don't have that option to use the FS app on the on the PC. But overall, I think they did a pretty good job. Um, I think, um, like I said, uh, numerous times, it looks very, very professional and working with those numbers. And I think if you also add your face location as well, I don't have it right now but I could see that, that it could be very, very useful if you have all the information there. Rather than having it on your iPad, I think on the PC will be a little more complete in my opinion. Obviously, make sure you have the right uh, graphic card and everything. Now, uh, the lag that you see in the video sometimes is not the, it wasn't lagging. It was only because uh, I was recording the screen. That's why it was lagging. But, but uh, overall, I, I definitely prefer this one rather than the FS app on the iPad, which I rarely use, to be honest. So I can see this um, using this more, you know, if I set up my PC and all I have to do is just turn it on and have a screen ready to go, I think uh, I think it would be pretty good in my opinion. So anyways, that's my review of the PC version. Obviously, all the options, all the other features are the same as the ones that you have on the iPad already. So I don't think nothing else changes there. Uh, it just uh, looks better because you have your monitor 
and it feels like the, the information is arranged uh, better than, than the one you see on your iPad. So that's, that's my opinion. Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching, guys. Until next time.